Okay, good morning. This is where I left off the previous lesson, the previous screencast where I made a turtle audio groove, the three track, three drum tracks, a kick, some kind of snare, and some kind of hit or hat. Um, awesome. Let's listen to it. Turn it up a little bit. My audio is not so hot. I don't have a lot of good, I don't have my speakers plugged in right now because I'm moving stuff around in my class. Mr. Z, I've never written a song in my life. Good. That's what you're here to learn today. Um, let us begin with the white arrow, the edit lines. These are lines, okay? Notice if I click the kick or the snare. Under the sound tab, it is a drum type, right? Okay. Now I have previously programmed this big square. Okay, so and each side of this square represents the length of one of these tracks. So this square is four times longer than these tracks. Every time the kick track plays four times, this melody will go around once. So we are creating a four bar, these are bars, melody. Uh, I'm going to click on this track, though. This changed to the synth option here. I can always go switch from drums to synth. Okay, so we previously used uh, drums. Today, we're only working with a synth, and we're only going to do this one track. Um, I find it easy to just paint some notes down. And I, since my name starts with a C, I'm going to lay down some C notes here. So I'm going to click on the paint option. And I'll find a C note, Let's see, A, B, C. This is a piano, this is a rainbow piano keyboard, by the way. I'm gonna drop C right at the beginning, maybe one, two, three. Turn it up a little bit. Okay. I'm gonna turn the melody up, the volume. So I've gone back into the sound tab, and I'm gonna turn volume up, so you can hear it a little better. Awesome. I'm gonna go back to paint. And I'm gonna put those C notes elsewhere, randomly, look. Okay. This, this, this doesn't sound too bad already. If you wanna delete things, there is no eraser. You simply paint over it again. Click again to turn it back on. Okay. Um, now I'm gonna start adding a different note. In my case, I'm gonna use an F note, F. C and F, sometimes they go together well. So. Ooh. I, uh, I now invite you to explore. We might uh, be remixing other people's creations later. You're gonna watch me add now some Bs in here. But maybe I wanna do like a high B. B4. That's fun, that's cute. That was a B and a C next to each other. Um, I'm gonna put something that maybe doesn't sound so hot. This is F sharp. So that to me is like a little off. Um, I'll have you maybe avoid these top keys up here. These are like the black keys on the piano. Um, let's see how G sounds in here. Ooh. Ba -ba -ba -bum. Cool. So I, I, I kind of try to make it sparse. You know, there's some parts where it's very busy, other parts where it's not so much. Um, I invite you to just play around and make a melody. There's really nothing you can do wrong. 
It might sound great to me. It might sound terrible to you. It might sound terrible to you. It might sound great to me. Um, I could give you all sorts of scenarios here, uh, but that's okay. Please just get this going. Even this is not the finished product. Um, ooh, I wanna show you other options too, or the sound tabs. If you like a different sound, so this is more advanced, use a different oscillator. Right now we're using a sine wave. It's a very smooth sounding thing. A saw is opposite. It's a little grating. Triangle wave. That one sounds nice. Square wave. Uh, you might also want to play around with under the envelope. There is a D option. D lets you change the decay. Attack, decay, sustain, release. Decay is kind of the easiest to explain to uh, youngsters like yourself. If I turn this down. Ooh, ooh. That's cool. So that's a shorter decay. Let's do a really long decay. So that one kind of like sings out a little more, right? I think it's more dancey if I turn that down a little bit. Uh, my thing's glitching. I apologize. Okay, again, to submit, once you're happy with your melody, you're going to create a URL down here in the lower right next to the trash can. Absolutely do not click on the trash can. Create URL. And now we have like a new URL, a remixed version of your last thing, an edited version of your last thing. Um, yes, awesome. Please enjoy, copy this where it says copy, and you're going to paste that into the Google form. And the Google form looks like this, Turtle Audio Melody. Please paste the URL of the Turtle Audio down here. Uh, remember, don't forget to create URL and then copy it. If you don't copy it, you'll turn in something different. You do not want to turn in the URL from up here unless you refresh the page. Uh, those are some of the ways you could succeed and mess up sometimes. So I hope you enjoyed, and I can't wait to meet you guys in person next week. And, and now I stop. Stop. <laughs>